Hi, my name is Michelle Yarovsky, and I'm the product owner of Insights, UiPath's new end-to-end -end analytics solution. I'll be taking you on a quick tour of our new RPA analytics capabilities today. Insights will be launched from the left side of the orchestrator pane, taking you directly to the Insights homepage, your dashboard library. Out of the box, you'll get four dashboards, robots, processes, queues, and business ROI. Click on any of your dashboards to open it, right up with an orchestrator. Scroll through and see how your robots are doing. You can filter your dashboard by specific robot or turn it off completely. If you wanted to export this dashboard or any individual widget, you could easily send or save a PDF with just a few simple clicks. Now let's take a deeper look at how you can build and customize your own dashboards. Click the edit button to launch you into our insights portal where you can create and edit dashboards. So let's start by creating a new widget within our existing robots dashboard. We'll start by selecting this new widget button, pick our data, let's use process name. Now we'll click this advanced configuration button and select a chart type. Let's go with a pie chart. We'd like to see the number of process runs for every process name. So we'll just go to value, search for process name, pick count all, and here we go. We just want to track the number of processes to run, but you could write your own custom formula by going to this FX button and see all of the functions available to you. While we're here, put this back. And we can turn on narrative, which is a customizable ML-based text analysis feature. This will add a written description of what happened in your widget. Narrative is customizable. You can adjust the format, pick where it's displayed, details, and you can also change the sentiment. Now let's go back to the robots dashboard and we can take a look at our robot utilization for unattended robots. We've turned on our forecasting capabilities, which will help you with capacity planning. You can set your own custom regressions and you can easily overlay pro predicted future states and then strategically adjust your deployment. For example, once your robot utilization hits 23 or 23 and a half hours a day, it's probably time to add more robots. If you're worried about this and you wanna increase your awareness while being away from insights, you can add these metrics to Pulse. Pulse is our alerting mechanism. I'd definitely like to know when my robot utilization is above 23 and a half hours a day. So I'll go to my utilization, add it to pulse, select the threshold value, put in 23 and a half, click advanced, to select who this alert should go to, and pick how they're alerted. You can also set up smaller alerts, which include anomaly detection and a constant alerting mechanism for your most critical metrics. If we want to take a look at the business side of things, we can come to our ROI dashboard. And the neat thing about this dashboard is that all of these values are calculated formulas based on inputs given to this widget. You can enter in the manual time in minutes it would take to accomplish one iteration of an invoice processing and the hourly cost. And everything else is calculated. If I were to forget and need to come back and change the value to, let's say, 40 minutes, you can enter that in and everything else will update. All of these formulas are completely customizable. You can change the names of any of these values here. You can add more columns and you can rewrite all of the formulas to suit the best ROI that works for you. Now, earlier we talked about exporting a dashboard to PDF. You can also share dashboards between Insights users. To do that, duplicate one of these dashboards. Click the share button. Now pick who that dashboard is shared with and pick the way in which it's shared with them, whether it's an email report or a PDF attachment that you can customize. You can also schedule the frequency for a specific day or every day and set the time. Thank you so much for taking this tour of UiPath Insights and look forward to seeing you in the future videos.